Hey everybody, welcome back to Gothic 3. Here we are outside of Geldern. Let's pick up some plants around here. Actually, this chest, since it's right here. Just, uh... I mean, clear side of the, uh... Town gates, you'd think they'd... Walk over here and see what's in it, you know? And I know I saw a healing plant over here, if this lag would go away. Actually, you know what, let's just go into Geldern. Enough of this. Ah, oh, mushroom. All right, Gelder. Gelder. No idea why it's lagging. Let's see if there's a guy guarding this place over here. If it will stop lagging. And there is. Hmm, let's see something here. Too hard. Alright, yeah, we can't open that anyway. Uh, let me talk to what's his name over here. Yeah. If this lag will go away. Just stop screwing. There we go. At last. High time you move your butt over here. So, here you are, Laris. On the lookout for booty again? Old habits die hard. That's especially true for thieves. I've got a really big score going right now. I bet this will interest you too. You disappeared pretty quickly after we got here with our ship. I saw the attacking pirates from the Esmeralda's deck, so I decided to make myself scarce. Open battle against pirates is more your cup of tea. I prefer to fade into the woodwork, as you're well aware. Will you help me brush up on my thieving skills? <laughs> of course I will. You know that. Teach me something about thievery. All right, let's see here. Oh, don't want pockets. You aren't ready for that. Ah, uh, 16 thieving points. All right, what are we going to do? See, so we have... 25 right now, I think. Let's think this out for a second. So, where is there anything to be had here? I accepted an assignment from a rich hashishi merchant. He says that the shaman set up six very valuable golden plates in the temple. He wants them, and he's willing to shell out an incredible amount of gold for them. Who is this merchant you work for? He's a wealthy hashishi from the desert. Boring fellow, but he's loaded. I see. How much will you get for the shaman's golden plates? A huge amount of gold. Enough for both of us, my friend. I just can't get into the damn temple. <laughs> but I know you'll be able to pull it off somehow. Bring me the six gold plates, and I'll give you a pile of gold coins for them. What do you say? Sounds fair to me. All right, yeah, we have 25 learning points, and we're not going to level up anytime soon. So, huh... Let's see, does resistance to poison and disease, do they cost five learning points or one learning point? One second, let me, let me talk to this guy and read this first. Uninteresting. Oh, that's too bad. Have we met? I wouldn't know where. I'm an old man. I can't remember every face anymore. You know? I see. Who are you? Where? Let me think for a moment. I think I'm Renwick, aren't I? Yes, my name is Renwick. What are you doing here? I guess. Uh, pardon me? I ask what you're doing here. Caps. Uh, oh, I almost had it. No, I forgot. You're an alchemist. Yes, exactly. That's it. Thank you, son. Now I remember. Yes, alchemist. Can I help you, old man? Uh, certainly. Uh, uh, what was I about to make again? A potion. Right. It was even a very powerful one. <sighs> All I'm missing is a bunch of things. Sorry. It's very rare. Yes, it is. Go and bring it to me, all right? 
Then we can chat about alchemy some more. You mean you could teach me alchemy then? Teach? Ah, oh, yes, yes, of course. I can do that too. I see. Ah, oh, you look familiar. Do I know you? You are the alchemist Renwick, and I am the fellow who has the privilege of getting you King Sorel. Right! That was it! It's like 50 first dates, except we're not dating this guy, and he's old. Uh, let's see. And we're not Adam Sandler. Let's see. I think it's just one, so... Here, I have your King Sorel. King Sorel? Really? Oh, that's wonderful! That I can devote myself once again to my, uh... <laughs> you can devote yourself to your potions again. Right! That was it! Take this as thanks, son. Show me how to protect myself against illness. There are two possibilities. Accept the illness and crawl off to bed. I'm sure you already know about medicine and all that stuff. Or you ignore the disease. Your body is stronger. You'll find that no disease can spread in your body without your consent. It's just as easy as that. Can you sell me some potions? Potions, you say? Ah, uh, yes, I think so. Show me your potions. Uh, it could be that I have some. Uh, uh, take a look, son. Alright, he has some gold, finally. Uh, yeah, you can also get resistance to poison in Geldern, and I forgot exactly where. But I know it's here, so we'll just ha we'll be talking to anybody, uh, or I mean everybody anyway. So we're bound to find it eventually. Uh, nothing I want to sell there, nothing I want to sell here. W wait, what is that? Poison? Never an ingredient of a healing potion. Well, that's insightful. Uh, let's see. I guess that's all I want to sell. What does he have over here? Extremely expensive rings. Oh, hey, a stone tablet. Probably want to grab that. Uh, what is that? That's an antidote. Never mind. Some healing plants. Potions. We don't have the stuff to make. Might as well do that before we forget. And, uh, yeah, right here. Resistance to disease. The hero is immune to diseases. What? Uh, okay, I just have an audience, I guess. Hey, guys. Uh, no idea what that was. Did I crouch at one point that they'd come out and think I was stealing something? What's going on here? No? No idea there. Uh, what was the other thing this guy could do? Teach us about alchemy. Teach me something about alchemy. Let's see. We don't have the stuff for that, right? You on Twelve. All right, I think we might be able to find that in uh, bookshelves. What's up with these people? Go on, shoe. Some chests. Is there anybody in here? Gotta be sneaky. 17 gold coins. Nobody in here. Who's fighting? Wait, was that a bundle of weapons? No, it was a woodcutter's axe. Alright, I know I hear, hear someone fighting. Let him have it. Yeah, no. dare to strike me. Interesting. Rebels. Uh, yep. No point in getting involved, really. They're not going to win anyway. 
So you loot this stuff, is that an Orc Slayer? Sure didn't make the Orc Slayer weak in Gothic 3. What was that, Coral? Orc Slayer, Wooden Shield, uh, of course we can't take his armor. Only makes sense, I mean, he's wearing it. Wow, they really have him surrounded. And I'm stuck in a tree trunk. Never mind, there you go. You should have put down your weapon. <laughs> uh, put down our weapon. Uh, yeah. Oh well, we can deal with silly things like that. See, there's what's his name. I don't think I. Man, I'm kind of wrestling between getting pick difficult locks right now. What do we have? 8,000 experience points to the next level. I say we go ahead and get it. You aren't ready for that. Alright, that takes 16 and we have... Wait, we only have 20, right? Can't get it anyway. Uh, who can we talk to real fast? I was going to go get that uh, helmet real fast, but I might as well just go grab the fire chalice. Actually, where is the teleport stone in here? Huh. I think it may be in a cave back behind the town. Not too sure on that one. Yeah, I just don't want to forget when it comes to the fire chalice. Backtracking is easy in this game, though. You know, with the... Uh, Teleport runes. That was random lag. Okay, that's not it. And yeah, there we go. Fire Chalice. And I think I will end the episode with that. I'll probably head out of this cave uh, before I start the next episode. Just to cut that out. There's really nothing to do in the mine that I know of. So yeah, thanks for watching and I will see you all next time.